When we read in the curses about Deuteronomy 28, verse 35, it say the knees, the legs, a sore bouch that cannot be healed. This is not from a sports injury or a turn of ACL or the fall of times. This is from a disease, a sickness, or inflammatory virus. The global burden of disease revealed 71.3% death caused by dietary lifestyle choices. We understand that the dietary plays a major effect on our health. Let's see if God have a dietary law that can be a remedy for our bodies. When you read Leviticus chapter 11, verse 47, it said to make a difference between the unclean and clean, between the beasts that they may be eaten and the beasts that may not be eaten. So now we understand that when you read the scriptures, it tells you that God have a dietary law. When you read chapter 11, verse 7, it goes into some of the popular meats that we eat that are unclean. The swine, as you read on down, it goes into the shrimp, the catfish, you have the lobster. These creatures are created for a good purpose. They meant to clean the pollution of the land and water. For as the clean animals that we can eat, it requires a balance. It says in Sirach 31 verse 19, a very little is sufficient for a man that's well nurtured. So we have to understand that we don't live to eat emotional eating. Like I eat when I'm happy, I eat when I'm sad, I eat when I'm frustrated, I eat for joy. These things we are not supposed to do. When you eat to live, you need vitamins, you need proteins. These are the things that we understand when it comes to eating. The scriptures say little is sufficient for a man that's well nurtured. We don't need that much. When you read Sirach 37 and verse 29, it says, be not unstable in any dainty thing, nor too greedy upon meat. So when we read that, do not overdo it. Do not be overindulgent in sweets. That's what dainty means. Sugary, sodas, cupcakes, and what comes with that? It comes with diabetes. And the curses in Deuteronomy is telling you that we will lose a sense of awareness on our diet. What you put on the meat, salt. So we season our meat until I like it, not because it's good for our body portion. A lot of us is born with family with high blood pressure. That's what the season can call heart disease. It can create cancers. So rock 38 and 15, it said, he that sinned before his maker, let him fall in the hand of the physician. These are some of the curses that's gonna fall on the nation of Israel, according to Deuteronomy chapter 28, verse 35.